Hi, I'm Dave Scadden. We're here in northern Utah on Manaway Reservoir. You know, the bass have just finished their spawn and they're voraciously feeding on everything in sight. Baby bluegill, perch, and bass fry are abounding in the waters and they're chasing them. It's been really good. We had a little winter storm come through last night. As you can see, we've got snow above 8,000 feet here the 15th of June. It's insane. The spring just keeps holding on with cold weather. But we're gonna give it a shot anyway. So hang on and let's get after it. You know, for years I've had people ask how to use fins on a pontoon boat. With the right moves, you can effortlessly move your boat around and do it stealthily and quietly while keeping your hand free to fish. You can see here how magical it is to maneuver your boat with fins. I don't know how many times over the years I have overheard anglers from a distance make the comment, how is he doing that? I can't see an electric motor anywhere. You can see how intuitively I can work this heavy cover. I can stay in perfect position the entire time and do it unconsciously. I focus on the fish and let my fins do the work. Huge advancements in fin design have made them more user friendly than ever. My new flip fins allow you to walk around with ease, then simply point your toe down and with two kicks lock in the fin blades and move out.
A rotational kick allows you to spin your boat for quick handling in tight situations. Simply rotate your fins to the left and your boat moves to the right. Rotate them to the right and your boat moves to the left. It's that easy. When moving from one spot to another, you can either slide your fins up onto your footrest or click the levers bringing them into the upright position, which works even better. You can see here that in the upright position, they're completely out of the way, giving you ease of a nice smooth oar stroke. With a little practice, you will be maneuvering your pontoon boat like a pro. There's no question that the use of fins will change the way you fish forever. I'd like to extend a special thank you to my son Dakota for some great camera work. This has been Dave Scadden wishing you great float trips and big fish.